Hello, my name is Ming, and welcome to my Honor Mode playthrough of Baldur's Gate 3. I thought I would have been done with this game after my previous playthrough, but with the changes in Patch 5, I just couldn't keep my hands off this game. I loved the story, but the combat and tactician felt a bit too easy, and there weren't really high stakes because I could just always reload to a previous save. But that has been fixed with Honor Mode, along with some other changes, like making bosses stronger. And as the carry on top, you can also now recruit a certain drow to your team. So I'll be trying to romance her. With that said, let's begin. Um, let's reset the tutorials in case people are new to this game. I have played uh, Origin character before. These companions have been in my party, but the Dark Urge is new to me. Let's play the introduction. My rancid blood whispers to me. Kill, kill, and kill again. My ruined body yearns to reap death in this world. And when this foul urge calls, it possesses my whole being. Injured, beyond repair. I know nothing besides this. I must resist the dark urge, lest it consume my mind. I must discover who I was and what happened to me. Before my twitching knife hand writes a tragedy in blood. Okay, so that was the dark urge. For my race, I want to be a half orc. Just um, base race, base movement speed at 30 feet, dark vision 40 feet. But the most important is Relentless Endurance. If you reach zero hit points, you gain one hit point instead of becoming downed. This can be very handy for the permadeath on a remote run, so hopefully I'll save my party once or twice. Savage Attacks. When you land a critical hit with a melee attack, you deal an extra dice of weapon damage. So I want to be a class that benefits from critical hits. And I have to use a melee attack. So let's pick Paladin. That should come in handy with smites, adding to the critical hit as well. For Oath of the Ancients, it's mostly support. Oath of Devotion, it's tank. And Oath of Vengeance, for some damage. Let's do that. 
My background is the haunted one. I can't really change anything. Good at medicine and intimidation. For my ability points. I don't mind losing a bit of wisdom. Let's go with 16 strength. Add to charisma and constitution. My skill proficiencies. Athletics, persuasion, those are good ones. Religion and insight are negative ones, so it's probably not going to change much. I'll leave my appearance the same for now, because I can always change it with the magic mirror. So let's continue. My name is Ming. You need a guardian. Choose one. Uh, I'll keep the guardian as is as well.
Here I am. The blood in your head thrums and pounds. That pounding blood obscures who you are. An overwhelming loss of memory. How you ended up amidst these hellish flames is just as hidden. You have nothing in your skull, besides your name and a headache. But you are in danger. Say your name aloud. You have a part of yourself. The Dark Urge. Whatever that is, that is you. You will claw back the truth. But first, you have to claw your way out of here. Okay. Let's get looting. Seems like there are a couple unique friend. dialogues for the Dark Urge that I didn't get before, I so we'll see how that goes. Anything of use? Let's just loot everything before we move on. Just ten gold. Something good here. I hope. Dead. A good. pearl. Nice. Featherfall potion. Here goes nothing. Interesting. Odd. I feel better. Hello, Mr. Goblin. I'm just gonna pick up anything that shows up when I press Alt. I don't know if they're worth anything, though. One gold. Okay, maybe I shouldn't. Hello, friend. We're back. Seems like a good moment to talk. from this place from this place you'll free us the exposed brain quivers in expectation please before they return they return I think you're past the point of saving tell me what to do remove us from this body from this case free us please okay I'm pretty strong let's break the skull Nice. Oh, a bit over. The brain lifts from the skull, but you notice an opportunity. You could cripple the strange creature, making it more subservient should it prove a threat. Your fingers twitch with the desire to rip its tender, moist meat to shreds. Uh, no, spirit. Alright, let's go. To the helm we go. We are going to the helm. We are going to the helm. Anything for me? Nope. To the helm. This is your end. 
Your head throbs and your skin tingles. Visions rush past. A dragon's wing, a silver sword, and a flash of your face seen through the strange woman's eyes. Oh. <sighs> My head. What is this? <sighs> Squaw. You are no thrall. Vlakith blesses me this day. Together, we might survive. What do you suggest? First, we exterminate the imps. Then we find the helm and take control of the ship. As for that thing, it will remain tame as long as it believes we are thralls. It may be of use in the fight to come. Attacker. I wonder if this All is right, I called this on this one. Maybe not. Victory awaits. Victory. Let's loot first. Ooh, spike bulb. Nice. Nothing important is All right, let's come easy. over here. Haha. Ha -ha. There we go. You prove surprisingly adequate. Thank you. Now to the helm. To the helm. We didn't get hit, right? Yep, no need to heal. Did we loot anything useful? I could use a ranged weapon. Um, can you use that? Two to seven, two to nine. Yeah, that's an improvement. Okay, let's touch the, one of the buttons. Dang us, you're doing good work. Still breathing, despite everything. Right around here. Come on. Shouldn't have wished to live okay. in us is carrying us. Yeah, maybe later. What else we got here? Can we go there? No. Okay, none of them do anything. More for me. I'll keep the dark mind though. Brain in a jar. Might be fun later on. Place your hand on the console. As you place your hand on the pod, you hear something. A presence connected to the pod, commanding the person inside to change. Mm. 
at the pull of a lever. How? If we are not purified, this may be our fate. Nah, we'll, we'll be fine. Before it's our turn. Another mind to keep. Another brain. A rune, but for what? A rune, but for what? Let's open this first. Let's have a look. And then we'll go rescue her. The console appears dormant. Use the room. The console hums to life. But what is its purpose? Will it free the captain or transform her like that other unfortunate? Turn her into a squid. sensation washes over you connection authority open the pod are you serious no way you feel the biomechanical brain of the console process your command and reject it what about Lazel? Enough waiting. Can you I do it? Blood. The console hums steadily, awaiting command. You do it too. Suddenly you feel a hideous squirming in your head. The parasite. Then discomfort fades, and another sensation washes over you. Connection. Authority. Authority. Come on, not another one. Oh, nice. You feel the biomechanical brain of the console process your command and yield to it. A shiver runs across your mind. You feel sated. Girl, she saved you. Got a problem with Gith the Yankee? More that Gith have a problem with everyone else. But there's more important matters right now. Survival. Let me come with you. We can get off this ship and watch each other's backs along the way. Alright then, let's get going. I'm me. Shadowheart. One moment. Come on, time to go. Finally. Let us make for the helm. We've wasted enough time already. She's right. Lead on. Sassy. Moving in. Moving in. Here we go. Um, does she need a ranged weapon? Short ball, perhaps. What else can you equip? You're two to seven right now? Nothing except my Warhammer, but I'd rather keep that. You have a shield, but there's no extra shields for them. And eh, they can handle it. This is fine. No time for Dally.
We are nearing the helm. Once inside, do as I say. Oh, and one more thing. Let's give you different spells. I want command, healing word, bless, and guiding bolt. Never a dull moment. With haste, seems simple enough. Deal with the gate after we escape. Connect the nerves. Nerves. We will connect them. All right. We're gonna connect the nerves. Oh boy, you're getting wailed on. Impact is imminent. I must connect the helm. Okay, I want Lazel to take care of this guy, perhaps. Come on. Survival is all that matters. I'll go over here. Come on, us. Finish the job for me. Thank you. Nothing will stand in my way. Now we loot. Um, you loot from this side. Yep. Let's keep going forward. Shadowheart, you're on command duty. Great line for you. Drop. Oh no. One more try. Yeah, let's take you out first though. Nice. What lies within? Guess we'll take this too. If we can eventually reach it. Us can go towards you. I should really jump first. That's fine, we can dash. Sometimes the only way out is through. Uh why can't I reach? Weird. Okay, I can hit you. Nice. Ready. Try again. It's our last chance. Perfect. Uh, right here. I think I want my main character to pick that up. Lazel, get the void bolt. Jump to it. What happened? Shoot him. And then I won't give in. I want it. Give me the fancy sword. Yes. And what can I do now? Jump. 
I don't think I get opportunity to attack, right? Hope not. Hurry before they strike. Yeah, I'm on it. Although I can't go too far right now. Us, what can you do? Nothing really. Jump and dash. Right around here. Let's go this way. Okay, Shadowheart, you're on looting duty. Fancy. Um, Guidance, Resistance, or Sacred Flame. It's only one choice, right? 65. What about range attack? 85. Yep. Yes, let's reach the helm. But first we loot. Why not? Really? Okay, we'll shoot from here then. Close. Let's jump first. And then hit you. Nice. Us is really carrying this. Well, so much for peace. Don't mind if I do. Okay, let's get all of these. And make our way out. I don't need to kill them. Not like they give a ton of XP. Actually, Still do I have right. a bonus action? So I can... No, I can't jump. I use my movement. Let's end this. So, Shadowheart, jump over here. Better take a peek. That was not a jump. Fine. Can we dash? Yep. Okay, next turn. Okay, after we loot, we should be good to go. Is there anything up here? Just a little bit, but not that important. What about this side? Uh, no. Well, don't so care. Much for peace. Shadow Heart. To keep fighting. Loot this one and get us out of here. The Helm's alien transponder. You've made it in time.
you half expected your memories to return once you were free of the Mind Flayer ship. But your past is still an aching void. If you don't find a way to remove the tadpole burrowed in your brain soon, your future will be as blank as your past. Your head whispers vengeance. You cannot wait to slice your way forth, seeking whatever wrought this tragedy upon you. Okay, so that's it for our tutorial. And with that, I'll call it a day. Thanks for watching. See you next time.